tap that like button. I want to see on the right side of the screen all those likes shoot up on the side by. Please tap that a couple times for me while I go ahead and head over here. It's literally right here at this quickie mart. We're going to be on scene. This patch, show me as investigating code six. Got a call from the store clerk here at the 7 Eleven. Is backup required? Negative. I think I can handle this. I think I can handle this. 10 4, copy. All right, let's go inside and see what happens over here. Uh, okay, it says, Ristream says, hey, hey there, I've gotten a report of some uh, suspicious individuals on the property. Would you know anything about that? All right, guys, we do have two people back here. One of them does have a knife in their hand. The other one doesn't have anything in their hand. Um, we're going to go ahead and take a look to see what this guy has to say, if they're being suspicious. He said... Oh, wait, I'm supposed to be talking to these guys. Never mind, not the clerk. Okay, the suspect says, sorry, something, something, something. Suspect says, sorry, I have things to do. Bye. Okay. Um. Um. Can you stop right there? Why don't you come outside real quick? Follow me outside. Um, I don't know if she was doing laps, trying to go ahead and get a workout on the inside. Maybe she had one of those Krispy Kreme donuts and she's trying to work it off. She literally is doing laps around the smallest convenience store on earth. All right, ma'am. Let's go ahead and question her real quick and see what she's doing tonight. Um, what's going on here? I got a call that you're being suspicious in this in the quickie mart. Nothing matters now. I'm busted. Well, I'm not saying you're busted. He just called on you. He doesn't want you in the store anymore, okay? That's what we're trying to figure out over here. So, do um, you have any identification on you? Wrist stream. Yes, I do have identification on me. Okay, can you go ahead and hand that over to me real quick? Hey, you. You got your ID? You got your ID on you? All right, she's going to hand over the ID. Why don't you just do me a favor? Crisscross applesauce on the ground right there, and I'm going to look you up in the computer. All right, her name is Linda Martelli. Dispatch, let me get a pet check on a Linda Markelly, please. This is the coolest security guard ever. Some of them have sirens, says Olaf. Okay, okay. Smash the blue thumb. That's right, guys. Smash that blue thumb. Uh, Linda is born June... 23rd 1984 her license is valid but she does appear to be confused and disorientated let's look a, I'll take a look at her record here see if she has any duis or any drinking and public charges driving without registration parking in a driveway she does have a handgun permit she's 38 years old she smells like booze we could possibly give her a public intox charge today and a trust no we can't give her trespassing because that's a public place so let's have her stand up attention all units let's ask her if she's been drinking at all today you've been doing a little bit of boozing over there grandpa's old cough medicine just a couple Budweiser, she says. Okay, copy that. Um, here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. We're, we're gonna go ahead and uh, we're gonna go ahead and do a little test on you real quick. You're gonna go ahead and stand on one leg like Captain Jack Sparrow for ten seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Attention eight, nine, Officer and ten. Patrick Berkheimer responded with 200 stars. She passed. Patrick, she passed it over there. So. She might not be drunk, but sometimes people could pass the sobriety checkpoint and still be drunk. So let's do one more over here. Let's do, uh, let's have her walk out into traffic and try not to get hit by a car. All right, I'm going to have you go ahead and walk out into traffic and we'll see if you get hit by a car. If you get hit by a car, you're drunk. All right, okay, she's going to go ahead and do that. All right, let's see here. Christina Boyer, Christy Haven, Olaf says wasted. She's definitely walking like she's wasted, units. guys. Officer Joseph definitely Ross stumbling. responded with 200 stars. She's definitely stumbling over there, guys. What do you guys think in the chat? Big old fingers for uh, Wasted. It did show up that she did fail that test. All right, ma'am. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get you with a... Uh, we're going to get you a public... In Why don't you go ahead and sit back down on the ground? Let's charge her with the public intox. Can security officers do charges like this? Does anybody know? <laughs> this is the first time I have ever was a security guard before. Um, let's go ahead and just give her this charge over here. We'll pretend like they could if they can't. Uh, public intoxication. Everything else is valid on a record. She has no warrants. Uh, Keith, Lizzie says drunk. Jeffrey, Chris, Carl over there with the drunk as well. Holy moly. Wait till you see this ticket over here. $1,000 for drunk in public. There you go. I'm not going to give you the trespassing. Listen, just don't be acting crazy back there by the uh, by the coolers. The, the clerk, he just didn't want to see you here. You're good to go. If you can't pay the full amount, call 1-800 wrist stream. Officer Brian Touchette responded Get out of here. with 100 stars. Get out of here. She make sure she didn't steal. Well, how am I going to know if she steals or not without patting her down? Because then I'll have people saying that I don't have reason to go ahead and pat her down. Dispatch, we're code four. You know what I mean? So I won't really know Attention if all units. she stole. Code four. The clerk didn't say that she stole. Required. Dispatch, uh, show me as 10 as well. Yeah, I won't really know unless I... Acknowledge one eight. And she admitted it, right? You're pretty much impersonating a police officer right now, says Sean. No, we're, we're actually a security guard today. Uh, Kalan over there with the police. I appreciate that. 
Uh, the legend, says Daniel. What up, dude? Andrew in the chat there, David Collins. Sergio says, what about the one with the knife? That was not the one that the person called on, so I guess... I don't know. Out here in the desert, they don't really care if you walk around with a knife Officer in your hand. Officer John Miller responded with 200 <laughs> stars. Don't ask me, dude. That's not the one that they called on. Out here in the desert, you could do whatever you want. All right, guys. Let's go ahead and uh, just patrol the area. We really have nothing to do until we go ahead and get another call. The girl with the knife. Yep, she's just hanging out with the knife. That's her friend. Knifey. Code Adam. Possible child in danger. Any available security units respond. Ooh, a child endangerment call. This is going to be crazy. Roger that. We're on our way. There's no children actually in this game, just to let you guys know. So the child, if there is one, I've never played this before, he's going to look like a grown-ass adult, okay? All right, so code Adam for possible child in danger. Store clerk reports the child in danger. Okay. We're going to respond. Dispatch, Richard, been route. 10 4 one, 8 I'm going to go ahead and come up here. It's somewhere over here. I believe they're going to be in a car. So, you guys help me look around. Man, that liquor store is dead. That's a bar, too. 3 o'clock in the afternoon, I guess that's why. I don't know why there's an ambulance there. Um, okay, last reports. You stop there. Okay, so there's somewhere around here, guys. We're going to go ahead and stop right here. We're going to be on scene. Dispatch, show me as 1023. Cad burst. Guys, the name, sit back and enjoy. Yes, Check it's a game, copy. guys. Listen, it's a game. It's yeah, a game. <laughs> we try to take things seriously over here, but remember, Ristream did not go to school to be a cop, so he doesn't know all the laws over here. We're just playing a game, trying to make that as realistic as I possibly can think it would be. All right. Brandon Armado says, the best rental cop on stream. Yes. I failed at being a cop, uh, cop so they put me on security duty. Okay, we're going to come up to this car right here. It looks like there's a child in the back, like I said. In the game, there's no children, just because the simple fact, if someone shoots one, that's a big problem, right? Um, let's go ahead and talk to the driver here. The suspect says, is there a problem here? Yeah, there's a little bit of a problem here. Who is that you have in the back of your vehicle? Uh, well, that's my daughter, of course. Why? It's something, is something the matter? Yeah, something's the matter. I got a call that there's a possible child endangerment uh, over here. So what we're going to do is I am going to go ahead and have you uh, follow me over here. We're going to interrogate both these people, and we'll figure out if that's actually her mother or her grandmother. Uh, <laughs> sup, Captain, says Mark Zuckerberg. What up, dude? How you doing today, my man? Hopefully you are doing well. All right. So the, the call is for a child, so I'm going to ask her who that is in the back. Who, <laughs> who, is, uh, who is that female in the back back there? We just hang out and smoke together. Okay, so, um, I don't even know what to say. I thought that was her kid. Are you high right now? Am I being detained? No, you're not being detained. Why don't you go ahead and sit down there on the ground real quick. I'm going to go ahead and see what this lady says about their relationship. She's saying that they just get high together. All right, uh, ma'am. I'm going to jail! I'm going to ask her if she's okay. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Let me see here. Um, okay, ma'am. Uh, is everything okay? Do you need any medical attention? Did she hurt you at all? I don't trust EMT, she says like that. Okay. Uh, let me try to figure this out. Um, what's your relationship to that woman? We just hang out and smoke together. Okay, so both these people are just telling, telling me that they get high together, I guess. I, I don't really know. Um, he didn't kidnap you or assault you or anything like that? Yes, yeah, she did. She did. Okay, and you don't want me to call EMS, correct? I'll be okay. Okay. Now, do you want to press charges on her? No, she doesn't want to press charges on her. She gets high with her, but she did assault her. That's what the call was for, guys. It wasn't child endangerment. I'm going to see how old this female was, and then we'll go ahead and be on our way. Maybe we'll go ahead and uh, charge the other lady. All right, ma'am. Do you have any identification on you right now? Anything that could go ahead and prove who you are? Attention all units. I have my driver's Officer license. Travis Reardon okay. responded Hand that over to me. 1,200 stars. Hey, Rich. hey. Put them in the Gray Bar Hotel. Put them in the Gray Bar Hotel. All right, Travis. I'll try to go ahead and throw somebody in the Gray Bar Hotel tonight. We haven't took anybody to jail tonight because I'm a security guard. This name is uh, Alang Alangica. Alang Angelica Hawkins. Dispatch, let me get a pet check on an Angelica Hawkins, please. Elijah Fast in the chat there. Josh Poulins. Sydney says that's not a child. I already told you guys. They're not going to show actual children in the game. All right, let's pull up her. Let's see how old she is. And she's 38 years old. We'll have to go ahead and see how old the other lady is. That could be her grandmother. They get high together. Uh, using a phone while driving hunting. So she doesn't have any warrants or anything like that. She doesn't want to press charges. But she is saying that the other 
female over there, whether it's her grandmother or somebody else, did assault her. Alright, stand up. They could have just been high and fighting. Um, okay, here's the problem over here. The other person over there is saying that uh, you did assault them. Did, uh... Did they assault- did you assault them? I can see injuries. Okay. That's not right. I didn't swing that hard. So she's admitting to swinging, but she says that she didn't swing that hard. Okay. Copy that. Sorry, guys. This is- this is intense over here. Do you have any identification on you? I have my driver's license. Okay, you want to hand that over to me real quick? <laughs> I'm gonna figure this out. We gotta go ahead and pass this one today. Oh, uh, what's up, Ristream says Josh Watson. We're chilling like a villain over here. Cassandra Fox. Related to Gerald Fox. This must be Gerald Fox, mom. Dispatch, can I get a pet check on, uh, Cassandra Fox? I almost said drill box. Is this GTA Rebel? This is GTA. This is. Then he says, LOL. Who's the caller making this child endangerment? I don't know who called over here. Oh, dude. So this must be her grandma. She was born in 1959. Wait till you see this one. All right. She's 63. The other girl's 38. Could be her mom as well. Could te technically be her mother. Um, different last name. She could have got remarried. Uh-oh. Hold on a second. This lady's got a charge in the past for aggravated murder and solicitation. So, she is, has an anger issue. This lady has an anger issue. Let's go ahead and give her, let's give her, let's give her a citation, guys. We got to start giving people tickets today. Let's give her a, let's give her an assault charge over here or something like that. What, what can we give her? What can we give her? Assault. How about disorderly? Disorderly. Since she hit her, but she didn't hit her that hard. All right, ma'am, here's what's going on. She doesn't want to press charges, but I am going to go ahead and give you a citation for hitting her today since you did admit that to me. It's an $800 ticket, and you two are free to go ahead and get out of here. I suggest I'm going to go ahead and suggest to her that you get in the car, and she takes a walk until things cool down. Until you guys get sober. All right. Off you go. Until they get sober, guys, we'll go ahead and let them go. Stand up for me. Thank you so much, Angelica. Did Angelica? I think that was her name. And why don't you go ahead and just walk? Go on. Go ahead. You walk. She drives. And we're good. We're code four. Dispatch, we're code four. <laughs> she just crap. Attention all units. Code four. No further units required. <laughs> I, guess, I guess she doesn't know how to drive. I guess she's still high, dude. <laughs> Epic failure. All right, so is it my job as a security guard to move all this debris out of the way? I guess it is. Oh my god, Rish Lighter. I gave her a citation. That's good enough. Uh, possible 148 and Sandy Shore. All right, there's a 148 up there, guys. There's a pursuit in progress, but uh, we're not responding to that because we are a security guard, right? Security guards don't respond to pursuits. Um, okay, guys, we're just going to go ahead and leave that right there. That looks good. We'll just have to tell the, st the store clerk that uh, the garbage can got moved. Oh my god, I was wondering where she was driving to. Yeah, me too. She's a wild driver. Dispatch, show me as 10-6. Going to my barbecue tomorrow. Going to make our way up here. Roger, 1-8. Get her for DUI? Nah. We'll let her go on that one. We gave her a ticket. It's the police job to go ahead and take care of all that other stuff. All right, guys, we got a lot more to do over here. I thought this was going to be a quick stream. This is actually going on pretty long over here. This is kind of crazy. Nick Hashback in the chat there. Patrick says DUI. Only your fucking security dude. response is requested for people loitering on a premises. Okay. Loitering. Copy that. Moving loitering right security now. requested. Okay. 10 4 in route. Okay, this one's gonna be on the other side of town over here. It's gonna be over this way. We have not been over this way yet. Let's go ahead and see what happens. Of course, I get stopped by a train. Well, now I can go ahead and read some of your comments while we go ahead and wait right here. A rebel says, be right back. I gotta go ahead and put kids to bed. Yo, dude, do whatever you gotta do, man. Come back whenever you can. Then he says, uh, just push the dumpster into the poor citizen's yard. Oh, they're gonna have to take care of it, dude. I, I'm only a security guard. That's not my job. Daniel Boyd, Kenny Lemon, Josh Pullins, Dallas Joyce says, wow. Yeah, wowzers. Wowzers, wowzers, wowzers. All right, guys, we're going up to a call right here. It's a loitering call. Group of people are loitering up here. I have never done these before, so I do not know what to expect. Alana says, hey, Ristream, what's going on, Alana? How you doing today? Thank you for coming in and saying hello to us. All right, guys, we're gonna be on scene. Dispatch, show me on scene 1023. 10 4. Alright. Is backup required? Negative. We're gonna park a little closer just in case they run. Looks like they're on the other side. That. Looks like they're over here on this side. Uh, Richard Kaiser, thanks for the GG. Neil says lights and sirens. Let's go. We're just security today, so we don't really need the sirens. Alright, let's go ahead and speak to these folks over here. Hey, folks, can I ask what you're doing out here? What's going on over here, guys? Got a call over here that you're loitering. Nothing to worry about here, just hanging out. 
Okay, I understand, but unfortunately, this place has a strict no loitering policy. You gotta get moving. Fine, come on, guys, let's get out of here. So two of them are leaving, and one of them is refusing. Oh, you won't get rid of me that easy. Oh, she's got a gun! She's not using it, guys, but she does have a gun. I don't know what she's gonna do with it. Let's call for backup. Dispatch requesting backup. She does have a weapon in her hand, and she did threaten me. All right. Maybe I shouldn't get in the car. I thought she was going to run. Here, let me hide behind my car. I'm scared. I'm scared. Um, let's wait till the police get here. They're going to have to handle that. Looks like they sent out the state trooper. Hey, buddy, he's got that lady's got a gun over there. You're good to go. Thank you. Appreciate that. All right, he says I'm good to go. Lady, drop the weapon. Drop the weapon. Let's get behind her just in case she tries anything. Crazy's done, she's an old lady and she has a gun. Can you please drop the weapon? Police, let's see some. Okay, she's gonna go ahead and drop the weapon on the ground and she's gonna get down on the ground. I don't know why she just didn't leave. Was it really that hard to leave? Said you're not gonna get rid of me that easily. Okay, uh, dispatch, we got one in custody. Attention, all units, suspect in custody. We got one in custody over here. Tyler Jordan says wrist lighter. I don't have the wrist light. We don't have a lot of our guns. We only have a taser and one pistol over here. We just we had to get the pistol a little while ago because things were just getting absolutely insane People were running from me and all I could do is tase them I end up tasing the one guy like eight times and he didn't do anything Nick block uh, claiming his point over there. All right, we're gonna go ahead and have to take this lady to jail I'm gonna ask her why she just didn't leave the scene over there. What, what's going on with you, ma'am? Are you, are you on something? Why didn't you just go when I told you to leave? She says I'm remaining silent right now. Okay, you did have a gun on you right there. I did find a gun. I'm um, obviously you're holding it in your hand. You want to tell me uh, who does that weapon belong to? It's my dad's weapon. This lady looks like uh, Hil Hillary Clinton over here, and uh, she said it's her dad's weapon. I don't know about that. Okay. Um, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna say, do you have anything? Uh, actually, let's ask her. Does she consent to a pat down? She says, pat away, wrist stream. And do you want a female over here to pat you down, or do you mind if I do? No, I want you to search me. Okay, we're going to go ahead and search her. Turn around. Uh, let's see here. Uh, high on life, says Joshua. <laughs> Brandon, Matt Pratt. Uh, TZ says, bro, how do you handle your vehicle so well and put mine out of control? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I, I'm just pretty good at... I can't, I, I can't say that. I, I drive pretty bad on this game. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I'm just driving good today. Amy Reed is her name, guys. Amy Reed is her name. And what did we find in her pockets? I didn't even see what we found in her pockets. Hold on a second. I wasn't even looking. I didn't even see anything that was in red. All we found was the gun. Let me pat her down one more time. Got some loose change in her pockets. All right, Amy, I'm going to put you in the back of the car. You are... Uh, what kind of charge could we get her with, guys? Anybody know what kind of charge we could possibly get her with? She didn't point the gun at me. She didn't do anything. All she says is you're not going to go ahead and catch me. And she was just holding the gun at her head. Attention all units. Officer Ryan McKee responded with 100 stars. Grandma's, grandma's gone, gone wild today. today. I know, tears dude. This of is, joy. Tears of there's joy. There's a bunch of grandmas over here today. Let's go ahead and do a weapon serial check. Let's call this in. This is a pistol. It, the serial number is Alpha 803492X-Ray. And the weapon is unregistered owner status not registered. Okay, so if it was her dad's weapon, he never registered it. So we could go ahead and get her with brandishing a firearm, um, trespassing, uh, and then the weapon charge as well. So let's go to Amy Reed. Let's see if she has any priors. She's 48 years old. Uh, no citations, no arrest record over there. Okay, so she's good to go. We're going to give her a public violation for littering and... Um, littering and um... You want to know why I pulled you over? Littering. Oh, officer, that, that's not ours. Candy bars. Littering and? Littering and? Uh, and uh, littering and? Littering and? Uh, littering and? Uh, uh, littering and? Littering and holding a gun. All right, guys, so she doesn't have a handgun permit either, so we're going to add that to her charges. She doesn't have a handgun permit. So no concealed weapon permit, right? I already got her with the, uh, the loitering. Uh, we got the gun, uh, legal possession of the firearm. We got the gun. We got that. We got. We got that. We got that. And you guys said brandishing. I don't know if brandishing is actually on here, so we might not be able to go ahead and get her with brandishing. Yeah, I don't see that anywhere. But that looks like enough charges. I think I got her. There might be one more that I could get her with. Oh, one second. That officer left me over here. He left me high and dry. I was gonna go ahead and have her transport. Sam, can you step out? I think she might be high. It seems like all the grandmas are smoking weed today. 
right. Um, Pam, are you, uh, have you been drinking at all today? Because I had some diet colas an hour ago, which means that, uh, probably did. Um, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do a little test on you real quick here. Da -da 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 -da. How much have you had to drink today? The bartender kicked me out of... If a bartender... Has anybody ever been kicked out of a bar before? Give me a big old finger in the chat if you've ever been kicked out of a bar before. I'll tell you, Roost Stream definitely has. Um, Alright, when, when was your last drink that you got kicked out of the bar? An hour ago. She got kicked out of the bar an hour ago, so that alcohol is still gonna be in her system over here. Let's go ahead and... Uh, did it, uh, let's give her a breathalyzer here. We're not gonna do any tests on her because she's in handcuffs. She can't do the test while she's in handcuffs. Keith got one out there. Adam did. Thanks. Jeremy. Dakota. Herbie. Nicholas. Sergio over there. All right. We've all been there before. Has anybody ever been banned from a bar before? There we go. Uh, 0 0.179 is her uh, BAC, guys. So we're also going to go ahead and charge her. Kneel down on the ground. I'm not... Ah, doesn't look right. Doesn't look right. Get back up. <laughs> that didn't look right, guys. Uh, I will drop her off at jail. The jail is only right around the corner. I forgot about that. I was going to call another unit over here. Keith Popple. <laughs> Ron Shaw. Dakota got kicked out. Nicholas did. Yeah, guys. We don't We don't, We don't. don't use uh, any current politics in the stream over here. Just because we want to keep it clean. No, we don't want people uh, People from all makes of the world over here in the stream. Uh, let's go ahead and add that to our record. I'm going to jail! Dispatch, I'm still at this call that you sent me on over here. Like, what do you think I'm friggin' doing on break? Come on. Right, let's get a Republican tox. Let's get a Republican tox over here. Here we go. Bada bang, bada boom. 23, come in 23. Do you need me out there? Do you need my right, assistance? we'll take her to jail. Let's go. We got things to do, people. Dispatch, show me as uh, 1019. 10 4, copy. Give her her citation for the drunk public, and we'll take her to jail. Yeah, she's. Uh, I'm. You're still banned. I. I probably am too. And this was when I was 22 or something like that. I don't know. It's. It's pretty far away from me. It's in the town that I used to live. Oh, uh, let's see here. Uh, I've never gone to a bar says Dallas Joyce. Good. Stay out of them, dude. They're not in but trouble. Not in but trouble. I haven't been to a bar in probably about been a, many years. Uh, let's go ahead and come over here. We'll go ahead and uh, drop him off. And the Gray Bar Hotel Motel Holiday Inn. Let's go ahead and take him in ourselves. We haven't been in there in a while. I agree, but not the place for it. Yes, yes, yeah. Don't put, don't put Trump or Biden or stuff in the chat over there. We don't need to see. That. Everybody's different. Uh, Brandon Brooks, Manny over there. Thomas Tenson says I have as well. Have you, Thomas? I can't, I can't picture Thomas. You seem, you seem like a really, really nice dude, man. I, I can't picture you getting uh, kicked out. I guess you guys could probably say that about me. I like, Christian, you seem like you wouldn't hurt a fly. I really wouldn't, guys. I'm a pretty nice guy. Let's go ahead and take the handcuffs off this lady. Uh, Ron Shaw with R-I-S. You forgot the H, buddy. You forgot the H. All right, let's go ahead and drop her off in the cell right there. And we'll tell her, if you can't do the time, don't Next do the crime. Time going to jail. Thank you. That's right. What are you guys talking about in there? Uh, they're booking somebody. Okay, I was wondering who they're talking to. Holy moly. You know what they call those guys? Don't say it in the chat. Those are called HBs. If you don't know what HB is, look, think outside the box. Don't say it in the chat either. All right, let's go ahead and go back out to our car. Uh, Josh says, I haven't been to the bar since uh, having my kids. Yeah, that's usually how it goes. Usually once you have kids, usually it's uh, bar time's over. <laughs> uh, Ristry, where's the gray bar motel sticker? Do we not have it in there, Roncho? I got to put it back in there. I will go ahead and get rid of the police badge one. We'll put that one back in. All right, guys, we're code four. Dispatch, we're code four. Attention all units. Code four. No further units required. Dispatch, show me as 10-6 as well. Roger. One. All right, eight. guys, we got, a, we got a couple more to go ahead and do over here. So let's go ahead and see if we can go ahead and... Uh, what is HB? Can't tell you. Can't tell you. Store reporting code if you added. know, you know. Possible child in danger. Any available security units respond. Uh, Roger child in danger, guys. Away. We've already been to a child in danger call. I'm going to code for it if we've already done this one before. Let's see. Yeah, we have. Dispatch code for me on that. We've already did that one. Attention all units. Code for no additional officers needed. All right, let's see what other... I'm starting to loot back. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Jennifer Johnson's in the chat. They're saying hello to us. Ed over there with his 288 days of followers. Requested for an open carry on a premises. 
Open carry on a premises. Okay, I don't think we've done this one. Let's go ahead and respond. Copy that. We're moving right now. We're moving right now. Let's go. Open carry on premises. I don't think we did this one yet. Starting to lose track. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. People, it's just a game. Lighten up. Yeah. People are just too serious. It's the video game, guys. It's a video game. We try to make it serious. We try to take it serious. But if I mess up or if I make a mistake, guys, just remember I am a human being and I am not a cop. Okay. This guy, show me S1023. Uh, Chris says, hey, Ristream, how I'm just now able to join. You're just coming. Four, copy that. Is backup required. Affirmative. I do see a guy with a gun on the inside, guys. There is a suspect. Attention all units. Officer requesting backup near, um... Okay. Door. I say to the guy inside, excuse me! All right, guys, I just screamed to the guy. Did you see me? Excuse me! You're not allowed to have a weapon inside that store. Even though we just let somebody go before for having a knife in there. Guys, go ahead and swipe down on your notifications. Holy crap, Ola. Mr. Ron Shaw in the chat there dropping you guys a 10 out there one time. Bruce the one Ramirez time. has right. been on the force for two months. I should months. probably call SWAT out here, guys. We should probably call SWAT. Let's go ahead and get our uh, little device out here, and I will call the SWAT team as well. Attention all units. Officer requesting tactical backup. All right, we're going to request tactical backup on this one. We're going to go ahead and move in with our pistol here. You sorry piece you of You can't crap. have weapons inside the store, sir. Advise, advise. Sir, Attention all drop units. it. Drop the weapon. You want to talk? Coming yeah, we're going to talk. <laughs> the suspect. Burgess joined the department. Says, what are we talking about? That's a rights violation. So he's uh, telling me that it's his right to go ahead and carry this uh, uh, rifle inside the store over here. Please calm down. I'm only trying to do my job. You're more than welcome to open carry as long as you leave the property. Oh my god! I'm only a security guard, guys. Back up. You move in. You guys, you guys have uh, armor and stuff. Oh my god. Take cover, take cover, take cover. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm hiding. <laughs> yeah, me and you. Let's let's hide over here. <laughs> I'm hiding. I'm not helping out. I'm a security guard, guys. I'm not a cop. I didn't go to training. Basic firearm training. Where's he at? Are you guys gonna shoot him or what? Let's go. All right, I'll empty my clip into him. Make sure he's down. All right, he's down. There's more shots outside, something going on. Alright, let's drag him outside. Oh. I hope it, I hope a little kid didn't want to come in here and get any Pez or any gumballs because Yeah, that's uh that's pretty disgusting. They're gonna have to go ahead and get rid of all those. Josh Pullins. Jesse says, Thank you, Ron Shaw. Absolutely, Ron Shaw. That was very, very nice of you, Ron. I appreciate that, buddy. Very, very nice. Alright, let's drag this guy outside. There are DiGiorno pizzas. There's Eggos inside the store right there. It's actually pretty cool. There's Budweiser's, there's Coors Lights over there. Kellogg's. I'm not going to show it to you right now because we got things to do. Okay. we got a bloody foot trail right here, too. All right, let's drop this guy down. Attention all units. All right. Officer Ken PMDRN responded with 2,000 stars. Gifted subs are given at random. Yeah, they're given at random, guys. They're totally random. So all you got to be doing is you have to like the stream, you have to be following, and then you check your notifications over there, and then you should be able to go ahead and get one, guys. That's how you qualify for one, okay? So if you didn't see them yet, go ahead and swipe down on your notifications. Check your little bell icon. Okay, so let's get EMS out here. Dispatch. Go ahead. Requesting a 1052, please. We're going to shut the road down. There's another guy Ambulance. over here. Assistance required in uh, Sandy Shore. This guy had a gun as well. Dispatch requesting traffic control, please. Attention all units. Officer Jonathan Langner responded with 200 stars. Thank you, Jonathan. How's your day going, buddy? Attention all units. Officer requesting traffic control near Sandy Shore. How about everybody left me here, guys? Everybody dipped out on me. All the cops. I called in SWAT and regular backup. Huge uh, homicide scene right here. And everybody got inside their cars and they're like, yep, well, we're done. He called me for backup. We helped him. We shot him and we left. Officer Francisco and I have to German do all the work. Responded with all the dirty work. Stars. <laughs> Thank you, Francisco. How you doing today, buddy? Nice to see you. Hopefully your day is going well. Jeremy says that was the getaway driver. It could have been. I don't know what happened. I was kind of hiding behind the building like a little sissy the whole time. Uh, let's see here. Patrick Warren says, hello. Hello, Patrick. Hello, hello, hello. I just said hello to you at the beginning, man. Big old tape Thanks for still being here, my brother. From another. Officer James mother. Bakes responded with 200 stars. Thank you, James. Appreciate that, Mr. James, in the chat there. And we got Ken also dropping you guys 25 as well, guys. So you got John Moore a bunch, has been on the force for a bunch of them months. for you guys to swipe down for over there. 
Death Canes, John Hunter, Sean over there with his followage. Uh, Brad Stone with the hashtag Ken. Absolutely. Hashtag Ken, hashtag Ron. Yeah, guys, absolutely. Uh-oh. I need Cynthia in the chat. They're speaking Espanol over here. Hey, something, something about her manio. I think that means brothers. Been on the force for two months. All right. Um, let's see if Ristream has the magic touch. We got to get going. We got to get going. We got things to do, people to see over here. Mike Rutherford with the hashtag Ken. Wally says, hey, Ristream. Hey, Wally. How you doing today, buddy? Nice to see you. Patrick says, I am still a supporter. Can't tell or get the... Uh, no, you don't have the badge anymore over there, Patrick. <laughs> Go get that money off the ground over there. Dylan Hammond has I'll been let on the, the uh, force for two months. I'll let the uh, the other guys go ahead and grab it over there. I don't want I don't want to take it. I, my character's already in enough trouble. I have to do good today, guys. I have to do good. All right, I wasn't able to revive. Let's get the corner out here. Dispatch requesting at 1079, please. Assistance required in Sandy Shores. All right, we're gonna go ahead and see what this guy had in his pocket. Awesome, guys. All of you guys swiping down like crazy over there. I'll fix that. Thank you, Patrick. I appreciate it if you fix it, man. Big old tan for a long time guy over there. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. X lax pills, zigzags, and a smoking apparatus. It's time to smoke, smoke, smoke. We, 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 we eat every day. All right, guys. So this guy's got zigzags, which people use to go ahead and roll the devil's lettuce. Officer Lane Strickland responded with 200 stars. But both these people are dead. They're both laying on the ground over here. I still have traffic shut down. Uh, we're gonna go Jacob ahead and, uh, take a look at this guy. has been on the force for three months. Let's go ahead and take a look at this guy right here. Milkos Johnson. Okay, violation right away. He doesn't even have a gun permit. Doesn't even have a gun permit. Let's go ahead and see who that gun was registered under. He's dead anyway, so it doesn't really matter. But while I'm here waiting for the corner to go ahead and wrap up the scene, I don't really got anything else to do. Uh, Ricky's got his Don three Bench months. Has been on the force you, for Ricky. six months. Don over there with the six months. Holy crap, Ola Burgers. You guys blowing him out of the water over there, breaking the stream. I appreciate that. Let's go ahead and check the assault rifle. It's Thomas, 868484 Delta. And it is a stolen weapon. It belongs to Lise the Sarah de Julie. Okay. So that gun that he shot Advise. us with Advise. One was stolen. I need a beer. I need a beer. I'm going to see if this guy will get me one. Patrick Warren joined the department. I'm going to see if he'll get me one, guys. There are Budweiser's in here somewhere. Are those Budweiser's right there? There's definitely Coors Lights up there. They're a little blurry to see. But those are those must be the Budweiser's right there. And I think they got they got Miller Lite and they got Budweiser over here. There's blood all over. Joshua has McKeon been on the force for six with 100 months. stars. Blart saves the day. Blart saves the day. That's right. Maybe a DiGiorno pizza. All right, guys. We got we got to we got to get going. I don't have time for that. All right, let's go. Dispatch. We're code for. Attention all units, code four, no further units required. All right, I think we got like one or two left over here to go ahead and do, guys. This is actually going a lot longer. I thought this was only going to be like an hour stream, but uh, this actually turned out to be pretty dope. I wasn't, I wasn't uh, expecting that. Probably be the only time we ever do this security guard. This is a punishment for me being a horrible cop the other day. Just that, show me as 10-6. Yeah, I was a horrible cop the other day. Roger, one, eight. So this is my punishment, security duty. Uh, Ristream, I was trying to reunite the beer wars. Oh, okay. Yes. Armed security response requested for an open carry on a premises. All right. I feel like this is the second open carry call over here today. That Was that one? Let's see what they say. Armed security response requested for an open carry on a premises. Okay. All right. Uh, apparently Copy somebody that. else has Moving a gun. Right now. Ooh, it's going to be at this liquor store right here. <laughs> it's literally right behind us. We're, right, we're on scene. Dispatch, show me on scene 1023. It's right here. My car is all dirty. It looks like there's ink all over it. Affirmative, send backup. Okay, now. This is at a different liquor store. Can I hide behind here? I'm gonna hide back here before backup gets over here. I'm only a security guard, guys. I don't want to die. Uh, do they have animal control mod? Uh, yeah, animal control's in the game over here, so if I get attacked or there's a wild animal, I'll call animal control. But not for me to play. No, not for me. Not that I saw. Hey, this guy's got a gun. Uh, I say, excuse me, I'm sorry to inform you, but this facility does not allow open carry. I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. I'm covering you. Okay, somebody's covering me. I'm gonna call SWAT out here. SWAT, send out SWAT. Attention all units. Officer requesting tactical backup. All right, let's call tactical backup real quick. Jordy McGregor, Patrick, Jonathan, <laughs> Brian Shepard with the 255 days of followage. 
Holy crap, all of Brian. Big old tan for my man out there in Montana. Not bro Montana either, guys. Remember who played that joke on me the other day? Bro Montana. Make sure those likes are showing up on the right-hand side of the screen, guys. Tap that like button a couple times. Okay. So this should be SWAT. They are wearing vests. Doesn't really look like SWAT. All right, let's see what happens over here. We're going to talk to this guy. Uh, please calm down. I'm only trying to do my job. You're allowed to go ahead and carry that weapon, but not on the property of this liquor store, please. I'm going to leave. Wait, he's leaving. The only call today that nobody acted a darn fool on me over here. He's still carrying. He's, he's, you know, well in his rights over here to go ahead and carry outside, but he was trying to carry inside the store. Let's stop him for a second. Wow. Hold up. Let's just go ahead and get his identification from him and just make sure that he's good to go today. We have a strong odor of alcohol. This guy reeks like friggin' booze over here. Let's go ahead and ask him what he's doing today. All right, man. Like I said, I don't want to be mean to you or anything like that, but the store clerk doesn't want the gun inside the store. You can walk around the desert all you want with the gun, yada, yada, yada. Um, where'd you come from today? You came from your house at the trailer park down there? Yeah, you came, you came from his house down there. Okay, copy that. Um, do you have any identification on you I could go ahead and grab? Am I being detained? You're not being detained, no. I just want to know if you have any ID. You can hand it to me, or you don't have to hand it to me. It's up to you. No, I don't have any identification. Okay. Okay, because I do smell a little bit of booze on you, and I don't want you carrying a gun around here if you've been drinking at all. So have you had anything to drink tonight? You smell alcohol on me? Yeah, I actually do. <laughs> I actually do, and I don't think it's me. Actually, maybe it is me, because didn't I just say before I was going to grab a beer at the liquor store? So maybe I smell it on myself. Um, be honest with me. Have you had anything to drink today? Okay, so he had a couple hurricanes at this liquor store. Okay. All right, man. Here's what I'm going to ask you to do. Can you do me a favor? Can you drop that weapon down on the ground? I'm going to ask him if you drop that weapon. I kind of feel unsafe right now. Um, now I definitely want your identification, because you've been hey, drinking you, a little you got bit. Your ID? Oh, my God. He put... Ah! Oh, thanks. <laughs> He pointed the gun at me while he handed me the identification. His name is Frank Young. All right, Frank, please put the weapon away. Drop it. Oh my God, this guy is definitely well in his rights, but he's definitely scaring me, dude. He pointed the gun right at me right there while he did that. Let's go ahead and look up Frank in the camera right here. AC Lynn's in the chat there. Kirk says, how was your day today? Kirk, it was great, brother. It's Wednesday over here, hump day really really happy he's got a suspended driver's license he's 67 years old definitely smells like alcohol he has an aggravated assault charge so he could be violent uh commercial oh he's as a cdl okay maybe that's my dad what's his name frank young no we're not related parking on a crosswalk or reckless endangerment as well okay so what do you guys think i should do with him guys what do you think i should do with him tase him says ellis ellis you can't just tase people Got a brand new Ricky Cadet All right. coming in, joining the force. Here's what I want you to do. Justin Powell joined the department. Since you've been drinking and you're walking around with the weapon, I, I just want to make sure that you're not drunk tonight. So why don't you do me a favor and stand up? I don't know how this is going to work out, guys. I can't get him to drop that weapon. <laughs> so what I want you to do is I want you to take five steps. Joshua Bond has been on the force for four months. Dispatch requesting backup. Shots fired, 10, uh, code 99, whatever it is. Code 99. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. All this for him to go ahead and do a sobriety checkpoint. I should have just let him go. <laughs> I should have done all that. Alright, drop it. Oh, there goes my car. Watch my car, bro. Oh, he got one. That wasn't me. Hit him in the leg. 67 years old. He's built like a friggin' tank, I'll tell you that. Drop it. Drop it. Drop it. Where's my backup units at here? They're trying their best. All right, guys. We're going to take him out. Ready? I don't want to shoot him in the head. That's that's not right. All right, he's down. That wasn't me. That wasn't me either. I was trying to go ahead and get a shot. Put my gun away. All right. Dispatch requesting. Uh, hold on a second. You know we're gonna get life flight out here. Attention, all units. Officer needs immediate assistance near Sandy Shore. All right, guys. Let's get life flight out here. Dispatch requesting traffic control, please. We're gonna shut the road down. That went very bad. You pushed them too far. Yeah. Attention, all units. Officer requesting don't, traffic control. Don't mess. Sandy Shores. Don't mess with an armed person that's drunk. 
apparently. Alright guys, let's call an air ambulance. He's gonna land it. Officer Eric Godfrey responded with 100 stars. What's up, Rish? No. Bada boom, I'm super late for class. Very. Smile, I'm off work tomorrow in NYC on Friday to Sunday. New York City, what are you gonna be doing up there, bro? That's awesome, buddy. That's awesome. You're gonna. He's, he lives in Maryland. He's gonna be going up for New York City for the week. What are you gonna be doing up there? Last time I was up there, actually not delivering. Uh, I was out there, just kind of discovering the area. I was never there before. I went. There's like an M&M &M place. At the time I was there, there was a huge Toys R Us. I think the Toys R Us is gone. Um, what else was out there? There's like a Charmin place out there. Uh, there's. M &Ms. Attention, There's a bunch of shit to do. Officer Ron Shaw responded with 200 stars. He was rocked by a hurricane. Has been on the force for four he months. He was rocked by a hurricane, literally. He had hurricanes at the bar, and now Life Flight says, oh, you got this. We're going to go ahead and leave. That was my fault for trying to revive him. Now Life Flight's leaving. My bad. My bad. I should have never done that. Oh, well. Uh, <laughs> I've never seen a security guard attempt a sobriety test point. I don't know. See, I, I don't know what security officers do. Uh, Kirk, David, uh, a little late for the drunk tank. Yeah, a little. I think he's dead, guys. Dispatch requesting a 1079. Let's go ahead. All that Assistance for that. In Shut up. Let's go, baby. Sucks. They could have simply just let him go. And now he died. Now I feel really, really bad. I, I think I failed on that one. Bottle of Hennessy and a Taylor Swift CD. Hennessy. And Taylor Swift. <laughs> Have fun. Oh yeah, Times Square. Times Square. That's definitely fun out there too. I've never been to the Liberty, the Statue of Liberty before. I've never been there. Never got to explore that one yet. Alexander, how you doing? Don in the chat there. Jesse's with the GGs. Big old tan four. And he died, guys. Well, there's nothing that I have to do. We're going to go ahead and roll out of here. That could have definitely been prevented. Put a tire here. You gotta be freaking kidding me. Ah. Let's see if I can open up this hood. This one doesn't open. It's locked. Hey, that's that's a funny number for our patrol car. We're a G6. I don't think we've ever used a G6 as a cop car before. All right, let's go. Got things to do. Dispatch, we're code 4. Attention all units, traffic control cleared. Attention all units, code 4. No additional officers needed. Dispatch, show me as 10 6. Did I run over that animal? No. Dude, that was a dog, too. That was actually a dog. He's fine. He's fine. He's fine. He's on the loose. All right, we got things to do, people to see. <laughs> all right, guys, I think we got one more, one more call to do over here, and then we basically did the whole entire call out pack over here. Pretty good stream so far. And thanks for the GG's, buddy. Big old tan for I see you over there. Let's see if we got one more for the one times over here. Wait till that call comes through. Antonio says hi, 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 a million times. Hi, hi, Antonio. Security response requested for a consumer refusing to pay. Security's been called for a consumer refusing to go ahead and pay for their meal. All right, if we go ahead and go to that one. Uh, I do see over there. Our bot replied to you as well. Security response requested for a consumer refusing to pay. <laughs> that one's not working over there. Are you a cop in real life? <laughs> do my streams... Do, do I do I look that knowledgeable to be a cop? I don't think so. Definitely not. Definitely, definitely, definitely not. Alright. Actually, you know what? We actually got a whole nother zone that we can patrol. Is this Polito Bay? This is. Oh, oh cool. Alright, guys. We can go ahead and go a little bit longer on the stream. Officer Eric Godfrey we actually got this area. 100 stars Didn't know that. And littering in. Littering and what else, dude? Smoking the reefer, maybe? I don't know. You want to know why I pulled you over? Littering. <laughs> Officer, that, that's not ours. Candy bars. All right, here we go. All right, guys. We actually got a whole nother area to patrol out here. I didn't even realize that. This is actually pretty dope. All right, let's go ahead and see what kind of damage we can get done. We'll just drive up and down the block and see if we get any calls out here. Uh, bah, 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 bah. Let's see here. Uh, I'm back. Says Jeffrey Yep. Yeah, yeah, Jeffrey Yakab, welcome back. Armed security response requested for an open carry on a premises. Open carry on a premises, okay. Let's see Roger what it says. That. We're on our way. 1012 Polito Boulevard. We're streaming route. 10418. Oh, it's gonna be right at the gas station. Dude, I literally was just right there. If they were smart, they would have saw the security guard. Well, they probably saw me leave. All right, we're gonna be on scene. 
This guy showed me as investigating code six. Oh, oh my God, she's right there. Copy. It's actually right there. Required. Affirmative. There is a female right there with purple units. hair. Officer requesting backup near um, Palato Bay. Response All right, there's a female two. over here with purple hair. Copy, dispatch. We'll assist. Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse me. Excuse me. I'm sorry to inform you, but this facility does not allow open carry. You're gonna have to go ahead and uh, dip out of here, okay? You can't be. You can't be here, okay? What are you talking about? This is a rights violation. You got camouflage on too. We got a true redneck right here. Look at this. Calm down, I'm only doing my job. You're more than welcome to open carry as long as you leave the property. There's a whole friggin' forest up there you can go ahead and walk through, okay? I got your six. Oh my god. Oh my god, all right. Make sure she's down. Holy crap, dude. Holy crap, Ola Burger. She is out for the count. Her eyes are actually rolled in the back of her head right there. What does her shirt say? Wasted? Insane. <laughs> and that must be her nickname, Insane. That's right. All right, let's get a helicopter out here to go ahead and see if they go ahead and revive. Oh my. Not expecting that. Assistance required in Palato Bay. All right, we're good. Oh, crap. That, what the heck happened right there? Your face said it also, Scott Or I know. Oh. Who got her in the leg? Ooh, that looks painful. Is that a disease or is that a gunshot? That might be a disease. I don't want to touch her. I'm going to let the, I'm gonna let the EMS handle this one because I don't want to touch her, guys, in case that's like some kind of an infection or something. Uh, it's always the cute one, says Ola. It's always the cute ones. Alright, she was wasted, alright. She's down for the count. Let's see if they can go ahead and revive her this time. I'm not gonna touch her until they land. Alright, guys, she's right over here. She's wanna earn the camouflage. On, you might wanna put gloves it. on. She has some sort of an infection on her leg. A, no, that's not a tattoo on her leg. That's definitely, like, some sort of, kind of a scavenge. She was shot in the chest and the arm. I see that. But that's some sort of an infection on her leg right above my head. Richard Kaiser, thanks for the GG. Rebecca Schaefer says I like her boots. Yeah, those are some nice boots over there. I don't know how you women walk around in those high heels. I, I just don't know how you don't trip and fall. I can barely walk in my own shoes. <laughs> All right, guys, what are you doing? You know what this guy is. All right, well, that's out of my jurisdiction. I'm out of here, dude. Dispatch, we're code for. I'm only a security guard. I'm not worried about that. The MS having some issues over there? Not my problem. We're going. Dispatch, show me as 10 6. First shacks of the stream. First shacks of the stream right there, guys. Absolutely wild. All right, let's see what else we got going on over here. Let's see if we go ahead and go down here towards the police station and see if there's any crimes down. Attention, all units. Officer Jay Bird responded hey. with 100 stars. Rock on to BCE. Rock and Jack on! Has tears of joy. Tears How you of doing, joy. Buddy? Tears of joy. <laughs> Good to see you, Jay Bird. Hopefully you're doing well, man. Jason Roberts, Dennis and Kim, James Elliott. Security response requested for an open carry on a premises. Okay, another open carry. Copy that. We're moving right now. Okay, let's respond. We're streaming route. 10, 4, it's gonna one, be. Eight. I think it's gonna be at a bar over here. Oh, is that a bank? What is this? I've never been here before. Uh, oh, it's a gas station. Let's park over here across the street. Dispatch, show me as 10 6. No, not 10 6. No, 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 my bad. Dispatch, show me as 10 23. Okay, we gotta investigate. Hey, look at that sign up there, the doors. Anybody ever seen the doors movie before? Okay. This kind of looks uh, very familiar to the last one. It kind of looks like the same female, but she's wearing a different outfit. Uh, they must be twins. All right. Um, what do we want to do here, guys? Let's get SWAT. SWAT team out here. Go ahead and talk to her real quick. Officer requesting tactical backup. Let's go ahead and approach her, and we'll go ahead and see what she's doing today. 
Excuse me, I'm sorry to inform you, but this facility does not allow open carry, okay? What are you talking about? This is a rights violation. Same exact conversation, it looks like. Uh, I'll be fine. I'm going to take my business elsewhere. Okay, this girl's actually leaving. Come on, you're good. You're good, you're good, you're good. I thought she was going to shoot back at me. You guys are definitely good. Thank you for backing me up, though. I appreciate that so much. You guys have a good rest of your day. I apologize. Fuck this asshole. Go! He said, F this a-hole over here. He called me an a-hole because I'm a security guard. That's not very nice. Not very nice at all. You were a security guard once before you were a cop, knucklehead. Jaybird, James Elliott says, uh, same marking on her ankle. Yeah, that's actually a marking I put on their ankle over there. That's actually Sleepy Kitten's uh, logo on her, on her ankle right there. Roger Cato says, good evening, Ristream. Good evening, Roger. Eric Godfrey taking a look at his points over there. Eric, have a safe trip when you go up to New York as well, man. What day are you going, by the way? What day are you going up to New York? Even Heather Stewart's over there. Yeah, he that Heather, that's still the tattoo that I put on the leg of uh, your logo. So funny that it's still there. All right, uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. All right guys, uh, let's see if we can do a couple. This patch for code four. Attention all units, code four, no additional support needed. Coming as 10-6 as well. Copy that, 1-8. Eight. Jarvis says, what's up, Richard? How you doing, Jarvis? A lot of static on the radio. Response requested for a consumer refusing to pay. Ooh, this is a nice, we never done this one before yet. Roger that, we're on our way. We're on our way. Okay, let's get our lights on. Okay, let's go ahead and read this one more time. Customer refusing to pay, Attention security has been units. called. Officer cool. Eric Godfrey responded with 100 stars weekend trip with my girlfriend this weekend. Hey, dude, if you if you could and you take some pictures, I'd love to see them on the supporter page, brother. I would love to see what you guys do in your free time. All right, guys, so someone's refusing at the hen house over here. Um, This looks like a strip club. It looks like a strip club, and somebody doesn't want to pay for their meal. Not kind of sure what kind of meal they're talking about either. Heather says that's funny about my logo. I like it. Yeah, yeah, we're on scene. This best show me as uh, 1023. Jared's in the chat there. Dennis and Kim, Kyle Rob. Copy. Observe and report. Let's go ahead and talk to these people. The waiter said, this is this is the waiter right here. She says, over here, I don't know which one's the waiter actually. Which one do you guys think? I don't know which one's talking. Thanks for arriving Attention so quickly, yada, yada, yada. Officer Jay Bird. Which one's the, the waiter? 100 stars. Get those bad guys rich. We're trying Clean to. City up. We're trying to get this city cleaned up over here. Uh, I don't know which one's the waiter. I'm guessing it's the guy. I mean, this is a strip club, so maybe it's the lady. What do you guys think in the chat? Can you guys type either girl or guy in the chat so I know who I'm talking to here? Because it doesn't really give me an idea. I think it's the guy. I'm going to go with the guy. I'm going to go with the guy. Because he has a tie on. Who goes to the strip club with a tie on? Unless you're going after work and you don't want your wife to know about it. Right? <laughs> Let's go ahead and talk to this guy. Wrist stream. All right. I'll go ahead and speak to them right now, I say. You're okay. not that guy, pal. Trust me. You're not that We're guy. We're going to go ahead and talk to the lady over here that's refusing to pay. What's going on? The waiter says that you're refusing to pay. What gives? Uh, that food is terrible. I should have got... Could be getting paid for managing, managing to stomach it. Okay, so she's not paying for the food because she said it was disgusting. That's not how it works. And besides, the waiter says that you were eating vast portions of food. If it was really that bad, why would you eat so much? It doesn't look like she eats a lot. Uh, oh, get lost, ball cop. I don't have to explain myself to you. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Wait up! No, 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 no. Nobody calls me mall cop. Anthony Holt has been on the force for She called months. me a mall cop, guys. She called me a mall cop. On, we gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. Hold on. We gotta go. I gotta get back in my uniform. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Dispatch. Why is my car so dirty? 1080. 10-4. Why is my car so filthy? All right. She got in this car and she's driving around the city. There she is right there. Dispatch, let me get a plate check. Uh, 85 Kilo George Kilo 030. I don't know why that car's so filthy. Zero, three, zero. A traffic violation. See if I can fix it. Oh, that's like crap, dude. Uh, James Elliott, Olaf says Taser. Larry says Ristream, did you see the trucker game setup video I sent you? Trucker game setup video I sent you. Uh, no, I did get a picture of some setup that uh, Lynn sent me, I believe. Dennis and Kim, Andrew, Jeff Keynes, Ellis says that's what happens to security guards. All right, I don't know if we're gonna be able to pull her over or not. Let's try to. 
I don't know if people know to pull over with yellow lights. Usually it's red and blues, right? Okay, she's actually pulling over. What do you guys think I should do? Should I pipe bomb the crap out of her? So she refusing to pay and she called me a mall cop. Not cool at all. Get out. Get out. Step out. Get out. Let's go. She's getting out. Okay, I thought she was going to go out and refuse. She smells like booze and narcotics. So she was drinking inside the restaurant as well. We're going to go ahead and bring her over here. <laughs> pipe bomber. All right. We'll make sure that she doesn't get away tonight, guys. We'll, we'll definitely pipe bomber. And I'm going to slap the crap out of her, too. Let's get a little far away. I want to step away from the vehicles, man. I want you to go ahead and sit down on the ground real quick. And we're going to show you a little something. I like to call. Up and down. Turn down for what? All right. Let's see what we got over here, guys. We got to go ahead and uh, we don't have any of these. So we got to go ahead and grab one, actually. I have to go ahead and grab one. Stand back up, lady. I'm going to show you how we take care of this. All right. Now, you don't have a car anymore. Yeah, that's what you get for uh, for saying that I was a mall cop. All right. Listen, you've been drinking at all tonight? Uh, I had a beer. A beer a day keeps the doctor away. All right. Give me a favor. Turn around. Put your hands behind your back. You're under arrest for not paying for your meal. For running from me. And for DUI. We'll get her with DUI as well. I think that was definitely a really, really good one. I think we did pretty good. Heather Stewart, Daniel Boyd. What do you guys think? And she's not going to jail, guys. You know where she's going, right? You know where she's really going? She's going to get a knuckle sandwich. Ready? Right in the friggin' head right there. She's down for the count. She's KO'd. She is wasted. That's what you get. That's what you get, bro. That's what you get for messing with Rishi and call me a mall cop over there, dude. I don't know what to tell you. What am I supposed to tell you, dude? Big old tan for you guys in the chat today. Super fire stream. I wasn't expecting it to go that long, but you guys came out there, blasted those likes out the wazoo. Had a really, really fun time hanging out with you guys. Big old tan for all of you guys coming in today. Daniel Boyd, Ant, Bird, Thomas Tenson over there with the GGs. If you guys do me a solid, drop me a GG in the chat. Means good game action over here. Definitely think we had a good game. Definitely think we had a good game. Uh, Dominic, Rob, Daryl, Steven, Ant, Bald-Headed John's got a new profile picture. Bald-Headed John, what are you doing to me over there? Uh, oh, shit. Oh, I forgot the one. Turn it. All right, let's do this. There was another car that I had. I wanted to drive around at the end over here, but I don't know where it's at. Olaf, 10 p.m. DRN. Thank you, man. I appreciate all the support tonight, buddy. James, Allen, Ant Wilkins, Heather Stewart, Dawn out there in Perth, Australia. If you guys missed the beginning of the stream. We were rocking with the security guard caddy over here. All right, but we still got to go ahead and answer the ultimate question. Big old figures in the chat, guys. Big old figures in the chat. If I passed. Am I allowed to go ahead and be a cop again on a stream, or did I fail? Give me the epic fail stickers or failure. Big old fingers in the chat there if you think Ristream successfully completed his security guard training or punishment, whatever you want to call it. Nate, Daniel Boyd, Nick Hashback, Larry says rock the caddy and run people over. I'm going to throw some pipe bombs at some people. I just got to find a good spot. Adam, Darren, Daniel, Jaybird, Bradstones, Dylan, Derek, Bonnie, Jared, Ken, Lasher, Don. Yo, Ryan over there as well. Lindsay, Aunt Wilkins, Adam Nunnery, Dennis, and Tim Waters. Has been on the force for five Big months. old fingers, dude. Everybody that I passed. Dan Praxton, Hayden, Aunt Wilkins, Dennis and Kim Waters, Jordan Armado, Michael Stephen Bancourt, Don, Dennis, Richard Kaiser. Yo, let's get it, bro. Ron Shaw, Don Benick, Albert. Thank you, guys. We passed. We're the best security guard around. I'm going to be hired at Ryan's school. All traffic stop. All traffic. Please cease and assist, Tony please. Smith joined the department. Dispatch requesting traffic control, please. All right, we got to kill this music, guys. We got to get some different music on here. Stop traffic. Attention all units. Officer requesting hey. traffic control. Hey! Jared Miscavish's birthday tomorrow. Happy early birthday, man. I'll be live tomorrow, so remind me again, and we'll go ahead and throw some fireworks. Say happy birthday to Jordan. Sorry, I got here late. I was sitting here running radar, says Bronny. <laughs> Ronnie, are you a cop in real life? I don't think you've ever told me that before. Bankboy Sheen over there one time. And you, Bankboy's got a new profile picture, too. Love it. All right, guys, you ready? Throw me some pipe bomb stickers in the chat there for the super fire stream out here, guys. Attention, all units. 
Officer Richard Kaiser responded with 100 stars. Almost forgot to send positive vibes. Thank you. Always with the positive vibes, dude. Always with the positive vibes, guys. We could definitely go a long way with the positive vibes. I definitely appreciate all of them, guys. Uh, blow him up. Thumbs up. That's right, buddy. Big old tan for Alana, Dan Praxton, Alana, and Scott. You guys are feeling a little bit better. Oh, Coors Light, you deserve it. Nobody likes Coors Light anyway, guys. Nobody likes that here. All right, we're out of pipe bombs, guys. We're out of pipe bombs. Thank you guys for coming in tonight. Super fire stream. You guys were awesome. Jeff says I'll see you in the next one. Ant Wilkins. I don't know if we're going to be able to do another one tonight, guys. That one actually lasted a lot longer than I was expecting. But we'll see if I, uh, I can go ahead and throw one together real quick. If I do another one, the cop one, like I said, it's going to be a shorter one, okay? gonna be a shorter one tonight uh aunt wilkins thank you buddy darren in the chat there as well russell brock with the knucklehead sticker ellis says not the beer truck it was course light so nobody cares about that right nick hashback says gg and rad dylan alana derek says later i'll see you guys all later have fun guys everybody shiny side up dirty side down we'll see you guys on the next stream peace out later anybody else earl with the explanation point notify earl got a new profile picture as well you guys are throwing me through the loop over here I'll do profile pictures. You guys make my brain friggin' rattle. I'll tell you that. But super fun stream. I'll see you guys in the next one. Let me see if there's anybody online right now. Real quick before we go. Ooh, Shorty's on. Bottom left. Bottom left. Bottom left. Say hello to Shorty, guys, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.